Hi, my name is Gary. I'm a freelance photographer. Uh, I am self-employed and it's just me uh, with my company. Although uh, I do work with other photographers from time to time when we uh, have larger events we need covered. And I would give Cloud Pano a five star rating. Before I was using Cloud Pano, uh, I started to use Matterport. Uh, I didn't use it very long though, just because I had some issues with um, not being able to edit the photos after you take them. Uh, with Matterport, you have to do all of that um, in-house. It doesn't, uh, you can't edit the photos. What you shoot is what you get. Um, I needed uh, a particular option to be able to edit those photos for a job that I was working on where there was a lot of repetitive um, areas in the building and it was confusing the uh, Matterport system uh, with when it put the mesh together. Uh, so it was easier to go in manually. I switched over to Cloud Pano. It was easier to go in manually and edit those photos and really make sure that uh, the quality was where we needed it to be. Uh, I liked Cloud Pano because I was able to go in and edit the photos uh, after I shot them and um, really kind of get the quality higher than some of the other products that are out there that you just shoot and whatever you get, you get. Uh, I also liked uh, how Cloud Pano would adapt to um, things down the road. Uh, they've added some features recently that, uh, that I'm using right now. Um, and uh, they're really open-minded when you send them suggestions to kind of really take those at heart. Uh, so the community surrounding Cloud Pano is pretty cool. Pretty easy to get started with Cloud Pano. Uh, it's not very difficult. Um, obviously, if you're if you're using that uh, program, you're already some sort of a photographer, or videographer. So you're probably pretty well versed in most of the editing suites. Uh, it's pretty intuitive to be able to figure um, figure out what you're doing and putting a tour together, uh, and then also putting in the hotspots and the navigation points. So that's another it's another key benefit I think of that software is because I can. Uh, really edit and put together a, a virtual tour relatively quickly for large, large spaces. Uh, and I don't have a ton of production time on the back end if I don't really want to uh, go into super detail on uh, adding links and hot links and adding additional media. Uh, my recommendation for anybody that's considering Cloud Pana would be to, uh, to do it and to, to do the lifetime uh, license. Uh, that's my only regret is that uh, when I signed up at the time, I wasn't sure how much work I'd be doing with uh, 360 virtual tours and how many clients I'd have. So I just uh, did the year to year uh, plan, which I don't remember the cost of it, but um, uh, and essentially you can get the lifetime license for what would amount to, I think, three years uh, of uh, subscription uh, when they have it discounted and then you don't have to pay anymore and then you're, you're, you're in forever. Um, I like the fact with cloud panel that I can also uh, you know, I charge my clients a hosting fee every year. So um, if you set it up right from the from the get go, um, you know, the, having the software and the cost that it, that it takes for you to get the software will pay for itself once you have a few clients in.